What's it up, baby? Y'all know it is the big boss out, boss dog. Can't poke through the door to talk to this boxing. So look, I wasn't going to talk about this because, I don't know, I I, I seen D-Town Boxing. He already addressed, he did a good job breaking this down. Um, Nocturnal Boxing Thoughts addressed it, did a great job breaking this down. But then, so I got asked by, you know, a subscriber, family member, contributor to the channel to make a video. And y'all know if y'all ask me to make a video, I'm going to do it, right? So, like I said, originally I wasn't. I wasn't going to do that. I was just going to, you know, let you know, let it be. But, you know, when I got asked, I said, okay, let me go and do my thing. Ryan Garcia is joining Derek James. Let's talk about it. Before I get in my soliloquy, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody doing well. Peace to everybody. And I'm praying for everybody. And I'm in from the bottom of my heart. Question is, do I like it? No, I don't. I don't feel like Ryan Garcia and Derek James are a good match. Um, that's my perspective. I'm not saying I'm right. And I don't think Ryan Garcia takes his career as seriously. Derek James is a no-nonsense coach. He's big on discipline, but he's big on the basics. He's big on maximizing on those basic mechanics. You know what I mean? And Ryan Garcia, to me, based off what I've seen, you know, doesn't like to be told what to do. Joe Goosen even said it. You can't coach Ryan Garcia. You got to, like, live with what he is. And that's been the reason why he hasn't progressed as a fighter, as skill-wise, because he hasn't received the teaching. So I don't know if Ryan Garcia is, is, is humbled and, and really uh, willing to get better. I mean, who knows? You know, it could be something. But I don't like it for Derrick James because all these people are running to Derrick James now. You know, you got Anthony Joshua. He ran to Derrick James. You know, uh, what's that other dude? Uh that fight at 175, uh, Brown, Marcus Brown, I think that's his name, who lost a better beer. Everybody running to Derrick James, you know what I mean? And I get it, you know, he looking at the success of Charlo. Charlo is a prime example. We can't even really use Earl Spence. Charlo is a, is a, a prime example because Charlo was with Ronnie Shields and came to Derrick James and has become an undisputed champion, you know? Um, so, Derek James is a master class teacher. So, you know, we'll see what he's able to do with Ryan. I'm just saying, like, based off the history of Ryan Garcia, I mean, I would I, I wouldn't coach him. That's just me. I'd be like, man, look, you can come in here and train, you know, I'm willing to give you tips, whatever you need, pause, you know, on your game. But, you know, I I'm I got a group of guys that I I, I feel like fit my mesh and my mode. And that's that's what I, I wish Derek James would have said, in my opinion. You know, I know Derek James want to help people, and you know, and and he's a teacher, so he's gonna want to assist and help guys get better. But I don't know. I, I just don't think it's gonna work. I don't. You know, Ryan Garcia had another coach when he came into the boxing ranks. Then went to, uh, you know, Canelo's coach, and then left him. And then he went with Joe Goosen. I mean, he went with Joe Goosen. As soon as he lost a tank, left Joe Goosen like it's Joe Goosen's fault. No, it's Ryan Garcia's fault. Ryan Garcia is the reason why, you know what I mean? Because he don't stay in the gym. And then he can't be coached. You know, Canelo basically told on him, like, look, man, this dude never in the gym. If he say he's going to come to the gym, he'll come later than what he said he's going to do. And then he'll leave early. Or, you know, or he'll come to the gym on time but leave early. Like, it's, it's things like that. You know, he in this city, this city, this city. So, Ryan got to get serious about boxing. You know what I mean? Um, that's that's just facts. You know what I'm saying? Um, but like I said before, I think what Ryan got to do is understand that Derek James is not going to tolerate you not 
doing what you're supposed to do in that ring. Derek James is going to tell you, hey, man, what are you doing? Get back on your jab. Stop playing with, you know what I mean? Like, Derek James is going to correct you. You know what I mean? He ain't going to hold his tongue. He ain't screaming us, but he's going to correct you. You know what I mean? I mean, when Charlo lost to Tony Harrison, they was back in the gym. And guess who was standing right there? Derek James. When Charlo, they was holding his legs and he was doing them sit-ups and getting up and punching the bag. You know what I mean? So, and that's because he didn't listen. You know what I mean? And I don't know. Uh, I, I don't like it. <laughs> I, I'm just keeping it real. I don't like it. Um, I, I, I wish Derek didn't do that. You know what I'm saying? That's just my perspective. That's my opinion. Um, but... We'll see. You know, but like I said, in this fight game, is you could be a talented fighter if you don't got if you, and you can have a talented coach. You could be a talented coach, but if you and your fighter don't mesh, it's not gonna work. Prime example, my first coach I had, military guy. No nonsense, bro. Big on discipline. Hey, get to that center of that ring, don't move from that spot. Take control of the center of the ring. That's it. That's what he used to tell me. Hey, make sure you're the first one. When that bell ring, make sure you're the first one to the center of that ring. Take control of that ring. You know, and I'm a come for a fighter. I don't retreat or nothing. You know what I mean? I'm coming for it. You know, I'm action pack, head off line, you know, vest into the body. That's me, power puncher. That's what I am. I'm a power puncher. You know, whereas, and me and him had that understanding. You know what I mean? Like, we, were, we was like, it was this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, when he couldn't coach me anymore, I got another coach. He tried to turn me into a boxer. You know what I mean? And it just didn't mesh right. You know what I mean? Like, it was just like we wasn't clicking. You know? So that's very important. And I'm just telling you from a fighter's perspective, that's very important. You know? And anybody who's boxed before, correct me if I'm wrong. You know what I'm saying? I'm just telling you my opinion, my viewpoint. I don't think it's going to work, but we'll see. You know, I could be very much wrong. I'm not sitting here saying I'm 100% right. I got everything figured out. You know what I mean? We'll see. It's just Ryan Garcia got a lot of flaws. And, and I think in order for this to work, he got to stay in the gym. He going to have to train with Derek James for months. Like, when I got new coaches, I trained with them for months to try to, like, build some type of chemistry. You know what I'm saying? Even we're on a hand pass, just build – chemistry and techniques and things that they want me to improve on. That's that's the difference. You know what I'm saying? You know, a lot of these fighters, they just get new trainers and then, oh, yeah, I want to fight. No, bro, like, so we'll see. Like like I say, I don't feel like it's the coach with Ryan Garcia. I feel like it's Ryan Garcia. You know what I mean? And if Ryan Garcia is serious about his career and he want to take it to the next level and he, you know, cool. And he meshes with Derek James, cool. But, you know, and then another thing I I, I see, Derek James' coaching style is different. Like, he teaches his fighters how to counter while being in the line of fire. I told y'all that's a video on Ellie Sackbacks on his channel. It's like five, six years ago. What Derek James is breaking down what he teaches his fighters. You know what I'm saying? How he, like, get them to change the angle, you know, while being in the line of fire to return. Like, Ryan Garcia don't fight like that. Yo, Ryan come forward, but his chin is in the air. You know, it's it's a lot that he be doing that, you know, I, like I said, I can see Ryan Garcia training with uh, Robert Garcia, Mikey Garcia, older brother. You know what I mean? Things like that, you know? But, I don't know, bro. I, I, I don't like it, you know? Um, but, that's my perspective. You know, uh, hopefully, you know, it worked, you know, because, I don't want people using Derrick James like that, man. You know what I mean? But y'all let me know what y'all think about it. Boss guy.